It's chaos time again here on MTG Unpacked. We're cracking open a chaos mystery box for patrons. And the lucky patron today is Benjamin Sullivan. Thank you for being a patron, sir. Let's do the dice roll and see which of these three chaos mystery boxes you'll be getting. Number two. Okay, so we'll put that aside. The one in the middle. All right. And the pack blessings today will be presented by Chandra and Liliana. And you may have guessed the theme already this month. That is Liliana. So all the packs are themed about, around Liliana along with the foils. So let's see what we get today. I think that's everything in there. And this is a new tier for the month for MTG Unpacked. So I think it's a fun one for patrons. All right, we have Ultimate Masters with a Lily. Eldritch Moon, Magic Origins, a nice foil, we'll take a look at that in a moment. Armand Ket, 2014 core set, and another 2014 core set. So let's do the pack blessings today. Good luck, Benjamin. Hopefully we can get you some crazy pulls here. And we'll take a look at this nice foil. So yet another Liliana foil. We have Liliana Death Wilder. Planeswalker Liliana, 5 loyalty for 7 mana. Her plus 2 is put a minus 1, minus 1 counter on up to 1 target creature. Her minus 3 is destroy target creature with a minus 1, minus 1 counter on it. And the minus 10 is return all creature cards from your graveyard to the battlefield. Alright, so this one is from Armin Kett. Pretty cool. We'll pop that over here. Move these guys aside so they don't mess with the focus. And let's see what ordering. We're going to go like that, that, and that. I think that'll do the trick. Oh, put that on the bottom. I want to do the Ultimate Masters last. Okay, 2014 core set. Let's get cracking here. See what we can get for Benjamin today. Okay, first off. From M14, we have Frost Breath, Sentinel Sliver. Who's a fan of the slivers? Oh, doing well already. Shadowborn Apostle. Our deck can have any number of cards named Shadowborn Apostle 1 1 for a single swamp. Uh, for a swamp, sack six creatures named Shadowborn Apostle. Search your library for a demon creature card and put it onto the battlefield, then shuffle your library. So, this is one of the few commons worth more than a buck. We'll put that over here. And next we have Demolish, Rootwaller, Academy Raider, Coral Merfolk, Mind Rot. How many times have I warned you people watching this channel will rot your mind? I know for some of you it's too late already, but others, this is a stern warning. The only known cure is to watch even more videos to clear your mind. Okay, next we have Hive Stirrings, Elvish Mystic, Uncommons. We have Shiv's Embrace, Staff of the Wild Magus, Elixir of Immortality, and the rare is a Witch Stalker. Creature Wolf, 3-3 three, three for 3 mana, has Hexproof. And whenever an opponent casts a blue or black spell during your turn, put a plus 1, plus 1 counter on Witch Stalker. Look at that thing. He looks very fierce indeed. And a forest and an ad here. What is this? Talking about limited events. All right. So we'll pop these aside. Next, Eldritch Moon. And of these sets, which one is your favorite? I can probably guess most people are going to go with the one on the bottom there, but... Let me know if I am mistaken. Okay, next pack we have Cultist Staff. Galvanic Bombardment. Wretched Griff. It of the Horrid Swarm, Eldrazi Insect. That's disturbing. Borrowed Malevolence. Stensia Innkeeper. Spectral Reserves. I'm grabbing multiple cards, no? Oh, okay. Cards seem thicker. Turn aside, Alchemist Greeting, and for the Uncommons we have Ruthless Disposal, Nullwood Dryad, 
Incendiary Flow and Rare is a Nusquef mob. Creature Zombie 0, zero for 6 mana. It enters the battlefield with 5 plus 1 plus 1 counter on it. And whenever a player casts a spell, remove a plus 1 plus 1 counter from Nusquef mob. If you do, put a 2-2 two, two black zombie creature token onto the battlefield. That seems pretty cool. And a split card here, Smoldering Werewolf. He turns into... A Erupting Dreadwolf, Eldrazi Werewolf, that is not what you want to see, or maybe you do. Island, and a Zombie Token, okay. On to Armenkept. Let's see if we can get a Lily here, or maybe a Lottery card, there's always that faint hope I have for pulling another Lottery card one of these days. Next we have a Tar Crop Skirmisher. Minotaur Sure Shot, Jeru's Resolve, Miasmic Mummy, Giant Spider, Nefcrop Entangler, Ushra Cultivator, Shimmer Scale Drake, Blazing Volley, Painful Lesson, and the Uncommons we have a Watchful Naga, Bone Picker, he was pretty good back in the day, Scaled Behemoth, and the rare is a mythic. Yes, we have Kefnet the Mindful, legendary creature god. 5-5 five, five for 3 mana with flying and indestructible. He can't attack or block unless you have 7 or more cards in hand. For 3 and an island, draw a card. Then you may return a land you control to its owner's hand. And I have a play mat of this guy. That's pretty cool pull there. And a planes... And a Tarcrop Skirmisher token. Okay, no lottery card today, alas. Okay, halfway through, Magic Origins. Next we have a Volcanic Rambler. Amprin Tactician. Fetid Imp! Smash to Smithereens. I think that one's uh, pretty handy. I've got that in my 8 whack Goblin deck, modern deck. Caustic Caterpillar, Knight of the Pilgrim's Road, Nantuko Husk, Zombie Insect. That's not something you see every day. All right. Deep Sea Terror, Leaf Gilder, Swift Reckoning for the Uncommons, Citadel Castellan. Zendikar's Royal and the rare is Helm of the Gods. So this is an artifact equipment for one. Equipped creature gets plus one plus one for each enchantment you control. You can equip it for one. And a oh a foil. Call of the Full Moon. That's pretty cool. And an island. And Thop the Token. Okay, we'll pop that over here, make some room. 2014 course set again. Let's hope we can do better this time around. We start off with the Pitchburn Devils. Verdant Haven. Archimancer. Duress. Altars Reap. Dragon Hatchling. Hive Stirrings. Advocate of the Beast. Sliver Construct, let's take a closer look at that one. All the slivers seem to be different, that one's pretty cool. Uncommons we have, Bubbling Cauldron. Colonian Tusker. Artificer's Hex. And the rare is a Stryonic Resonator. So this is an artifact for two. Pay two and tap, copy target triggered ability you control. You may choose new targets for the copy. All right, let's pop that over here. Oh, a foil mountain. Doing well with the foils today. And a island non-foil and a wolf token. Okay, so the final pack here. Everybody's been waiting for Ultimate Masters. Let's get stuck into it. Can never have enough Ultimate Masters, alas. I do not have the resources that Rudy has at his disposal to open this nearly every day. So let's go through this. We have a foil, rare, 
and we'll put our uncommons here. Just do a quick check. Yep, I think I've got it. All right, so we start off with a fiery temper. That would really ni be nice to have in focus. There we go. Ether Snipe. Terramorphic Expanse. Fume Spitter. Patchwork Gnomes. Kadama's Reach. That one's pretty good. I'll put that aside. That's over a buck. Twins of Mora Estate. Martyr of Sands. Generator Servant. Repel the darkness, and that is it for the commons. And incidentally, if you would like to get in on the pack cracking action like Benjamin here, I'll leave a link to the MTGM pack Patreon in the description for this video. Next, we have this amusing character, the Slippery Bogle. Young Pyromancer. Chainer's Edict. So there's another nice... Uncommon, we'll set that aside. And then, of course, we had the zombie token. We saw that earlier. The foil is... Vessel of Endless Rest. So let's get a close look at the foiling on that. Not that crazy. Very subtle foiling on that. And the rare today. What's it going to be? It is... Gamble! Okay, so not too bad. This is a sorcery for a single mountain. Search your library for a card, put that card into your hand, discard a card at random, then shuffle your library. There we go. Alright, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings, and be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.